Now let's go ahead and do a little bit of a speed comparison between both these phones. Obviously the OnePlus 9 has that faster Snapdragon 888 chipset and the base model of the OnePlus 9 has two more extra gigs of RAM versus the OnePlus 7 Pro's six gigs of RAM on the base model. So keep that in mind. But in terms of that, let's go ahead and do the speed comparison and see which one is the faster one enough talking from me. Okay, now that we're back, let me clear all the apps in the background. And these are gonna be cleared out in like one second. There we go. Let's go and hop out of here. Let's do phone calls, three, two, one. And kind of the same thing, I'm not really too sure. Animation speeds are probably going to be roughly around the same. Messages, three, two, one. About the same, I think the one plus nine is faster. Chrome, three, two, one. Probably on different web pages. There we go, hopping out of this one. Camera, three, two, one. I don't really know which one is faster. Maybe the seven pro, but the nine was just right behind it. Play stores, three, two, one. Actually, iPhone 1 Plus 7 Pro, I think, may have been a little bit faster there. Very surprising. Always interesting to see those types of things. Scrolling through, you can definitely see, I think the 1 Plus 9 is the faster one there. Scrolling back up, I think the 1 Plus 9 definitely is the faster one when it comes down to that one. Hopping out of this one, as always, a bunch of these third-party apps. Let's go and do Fruit Ninja, 3, 2, 1. And you can see even clicking on the app was so much of a faster experience on the 1 Plus 9 than on the 1 Plus 7 Pro and the OnePlus 9 is loaded. The 7 Pro isn't actually that far off to get into that next panel. Hopping out of this one, one thing that I've always said about the OnePlus 7 Pro is getting out of an app from this humongously curved display is always an experience. Okay, there we go, finally got out of it. <laughs> Let's get out of this one. And that's the one big disadvantage of a curved display, but I still like curved displays. Facebook, three, two, one. OnePlus 9 was faster, OnePlus 7 Pro was literally right behind it. Temple Run 2, three, two, one. And you can see the OnePlus 9 is miles ahead of the 7 Pro. I mean, it was very close to the 7 Pro still loading where the Temple Run 2 on the OnePlus 9 was fully loaded. So you can see there was quite a bit of a difference between these two. Getting into some gameplay, let's see if there's going to be a massive difference. I'm going to probably say there's not going to be that big of a difference. But that was actually pretty crazy of a difference if I'm going to say so myself. Hopping out of this specific app, let's go ahead and do something like Instagram, which I don't have here. I do 3, 2, 1. And about the same. Let's do snake versus blocks, three, two, one. And the one plus nine I think was faster just by a little bit though. Getting into some gameplay yet again. I don't think there's gonna be that big of a difference in the gameplay wise, this is a pretty basic game. Hopping out of this one, let's go and do Bofa, which I don't have. Let's do Dropbox, which I also don't have. Let's do Quizlet, three, two, one. One plus nine was faster. Hopping out of this one, let's go and do Snapchat, three, two, one. One plus nine I think was faster, but very close. Twitter, three, two, one. I think the one plus nine was faster there. Hopping out of this one. Let's go and do thank you, three, two, one. And I think the one plus nine was faster there, but it was still very close. Getting to some gameplay, as you guys can see, about the same thing. There wasn't really that big of a difference. Actually, the seven pro looks to be a lot more glitchier, as you guys can see. The nine looks to be way faster. That's actually one thing I wouldn't expect to see that big of a difference between the two. And we can go and end it off with Netflix. Three, two, one. You can see the OnePlus 9 again was the faster one. So definitely when it comes down to this specific speed in comparison, I mean the OnePlus 7 Pro, I think is actually still a very fast device. I think it still has a lot of capability. I wouldn't necessarily count it as being one of the worst performing phones I've tested so far, but it definitely is slower than the OnePlus 9. So far from the two apps that I've tested for management, it seems to be about the same. But I definitely would say going from a OnePlus 9 to a 7 Pro, I think would be a pretty decent improvement in terms of the overall you know, smoothness of the phone and the app opening speeds and all that stuff. That was one thing that I immediately saw. And I would definitely say it would be a pretty decent experience. RAM management seems to be about the same, but that pretty much covers the speed comparison. Let's go ahead.